And welcome back to Dreaming Does Gaming, Dreaming Dear Play More, Symphony of War, and the Nephilim Saga. So, one of the things that I did last um, off screen is I went and did a lot of group adjustments. <laughs> so, we now have a full on flying group with Beatrix and this Dragon Rider. Um, I added um, the new dragon. To Abigail's unit so now we have yeah we have this this is a huge huge cool unit um, and dragons and squad gain uh, X XP faster here too I've added you know an extra unit with with Draven's um, and a couple of the things that I did here was I added a cannoneer uh, with Lysander, and I think I had one more somewhere. Oh yeah, in Cloud Renders, because it didn't really affect his movement at all. So, um, so Cloud Render also has artillery, <laughs> so <laughs> makes his squad even better. Um, and one of the biggest reasons why I did that was because I tried doing this one, um, and immediately it got destroyed. Um, so I don't think we're supposed to do this one quite yet, so we're going to continue into the main story, level up <coughs> just a little bit, and then we'll, um, come back and do Gaiden Chapter E. I think we need to, to catch up our levels a little bit first, so we're going to continue the main story. Chapter 21, Liberating Sendraka. We've got the Empire on the defensive. Seems like they're pulling out their elite forces. The local army seems pretty weak. Our biggest enemy here might be the weather. This region is notorious for flash storms coming in from the seas to the west. Okay. Tide Reavers. Those blokes just don't know when to quit. Best worry about them, friend. The last thing we want is them nipping at our heels. If memory serves me right, that's their main hideout their main hideout. We'll have to send a detachment to that fort to destroy them all. The main group will push east to the port city of Crestmore. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> and we have a 15 unit deploy. Oh, okay. So this is probably what we are supposed to take care of. And this is the Tide Reavers. So I have a sneaking suspicion that there's going to be a few things that happen here. I'm going to try to do it within 10 turns. Okay. Target turns. One of not. Wait, what? Okay. So we have nine turns, So, but we have to do it within 10. I wonder if something's going to happen after that is why. Okay, so this is the Tide Reavers. So we want to send, oh, Obsidian, how we need you. Seems very loud here, one second, I'm just going to drop the volume a little bit. There we go. Okay. Didn't want it to overpower my voice because I'm already having a, a low voice. Okay. So. Um, to the Tide Reavers, we can send a few different people here. Um, okay. I think we send, honestly, I think we can send, like, um, Cloud Render this way. Honestly, maybe even Beatrix. Um... I want to send a couple like faster units that way, Barnabas, and then Roland can all be over here. Um, and put Jules here, a few people at the front, Diana, Abigail, Rascuja, um, Stefan. Can we actually deploy like everybody? 
Warlord. Um, Ephraim. Yaromir. Holy, we actually can. We have exactly 15. <clears throat> okay. Well, then let's do that. Um, begin mission. Okay, Cloud Render can can just get right over here and just start blasting. And so can you. In fact, if we do this, and depending how this goes, Cloud Render can come right in there too. I don't know how that was going to work, so there we go. Okay, I mean, that's pretty good. Nice. Let's send you this way. Take out these guys. Perfect. Then take over the fort. You guys can come in over here. Take them out. Pretty good. Uh, honestly, I think we'll just wait right there. <clears throat> Abigail will send you straight down and take out these guys. <laughs> so many dragons, that's awesome. Let's send Stefan over here because we can probably send Raskuja into the town to capture it. Nice. Oh, and actually, we can ambush them over from here. So let's just do that. Well, Sybil can take this spot and attack in this way, and then Ephraim can come around. Yeah, we'll do that. That'll be nice. Oh yeah, we gave you a uh, mage and stuff. Diana just gets to come down this way. Pretty good. True shot bow, nice. Honestly, I think we can do that. Actually, before we do this, let's uh, use a power. So I wonder if that will take out that squad completely. It did not. Okay. Kind of hoped it would. Well, I wish we used that somewhere else then. Okay. Well, Cloud Render then can go this way. Um... Yeah, we'll just attack in here. Pretty good. No one can really take that town right this turn, eh? Warlord Latatar will just get down here. Same thing with Yaromir. Anyone need healing? Lysander. Um, might send Jules this way just to help out because this is a lot of people. And Beatrix's unit might get wrecked here. 
You could send me this way too to help out. And honestly, that's not a bad idea just to start. You can always teleport next turn to get over there to really help out. Nice. Oh. Okay. Loyalty up. Nice. The levels are really what we're aiming to try and get here. Nice. Yeah, the more levels we get, the better. Big contingent of units here. Yeah, if you guys want to fight the pikemen, be my guest. Be my guest, be my guest. Ah, yeah, this is no good. Alright, so we gotta figure out something with Beatrix's unit. Maybe we need to give her both, or like another dragon rider. Maybe her cloud render and that guy can go together, and we can make something out of that. I don't really know. Oh, huge levels. Nice. All right. Well, that kind of sucks. But it's not really unexpected. So. Yeah, these guys are the Valkyries, so they have extra healing and stuff if they're just being attacked. Okay. We're just going to do this, get these guys right here. Nice. Okay, uh, we're going to have you guys down here, but we'll come over there after the fact. Yeah. Hmm, how do we want to do this? How do we want to do this? Sorry, just getting some emails. Um, okay, let's, let's go around this way. We'll tack in. We should get the kill here. Yeah. Big. That means Raskuja can come up here and get the uh, ambush. Also big. That means Lysander can come in and just blast these guys. Nice. Get Diana down here just to really hit these. Nice. It's like I want to, yeah. Yeah, let's do this. We'll just come in here. There we go. Huge. We're going to come around and force these guys to surrender. Nice. Oh, steel plate armor. Pretty good. Then we attack in from here. That way we're in the fort. Sybil can come over here and take these guys out, hopefully. Not quite. Okay, well, Ephraim can finish them off then. Right here. There we go. 
quite happy with that. Okay, these guys all need to be destroyed. So first off, they're in a nice little spot for that. So we'll do that. Hurt them all. Secondly, we come in here and just take them out as much as we can. We're going to wait right there. Attack him this way. Pretty good. Also wait right there. Cloud Render can come in this way. There we go. We can come in, take them out. Imperial Battle Armor, kind of nice. Um, I think we just go again. And just hit them there. And then be kind of happy with that. Now we can make it so you guys... Yeah, let's do that. Make it so that they have to like come out and attack you. And then we're actually gonna teleport you guys a little bit away out of the forest. Maybe right next door here. Yeah, let's try that. Let's see how that goes. Oh, huge. Nice. Oh, very huge. Silver arena token, nice. Yeah, let them hit the person who I think can heals at the start of every turn. Dragon scale armor, that sounds cool. Lots of ambushes here, which is kind of why I wanted to get out of the foresty area. roll on that does right well we're gonna come around here attack in nice and just move over one yeah we'll just blast these guys Pretty good. Lysander can actually just go seize that, so we will. Um, there's only this one guy left. Might as well have Abigail do this. Force them to surrender. Nice. If we move right to there, we can attack in, right? Up the wall a little bit. Yeah, a little. Oh, that 
that was only a wait. Whoops. Not quite what I was looking for. Shoot. Well, we're going to move people forward. Um, do some heals. Oh, you don't need to heal. Just wait up there. Yeah, let's heal you guys a little. Okay, you guys are all good over here. So there's that we want to get this. Okay, and then there's all this mess of everything. Honestly, I think we drop a meteor over here. Just hurt them all a little bit before they come down. All right. Nice. Just take them out completely. Um. Yeah, we'll just come in right there and blast these guys. Quite happy with that. And you guys can come in and blast them. And for the most part, these guys are all done. Yeah, quite happy with how this is going. Oh, they took out the wizard. All right, not surprising in the least. Well, this is who I wanted them to fight. That one less so, but we'll take it. Sybil's still going well. Didn't realize they could all reach over there, so this could hurt a little. Yeah. But we're getting levels. Levels help. A tremendous amount. Well, we took them out, but they're also hurting. Big levels. Seize the iron mine. Hmm. We're going to get down here with you. Cloud Render is just going to take these guys out. Okay. Oh, even better. Powers, Meteor. Nice. Huge. Um, next thing, Barnabas is going to attack in here once, and then they'll kind of vacate out of the way, see what they can do here. Nice. Because now we can get in there and just blast them. That's pretty good. Okay. In fact, we could even go again. Okay. Let's put Yaromir up here and start blasting these guys down this way. Nice. 
nice. Do you have the thing that lets you attack up the walls? Apparently. Good to know. <laughs> All right, Warlord Tatar can get up here and blast these guys, so we will. Not much left there. Um, that means Stefan can come up here. Nice. Denari staff and money. Now let's get to here and we'll heal this unit up a little bit. There we go. Lysander, same thing. You just start moving over here. Blast these guys. Nice. Huge. And that means you guys can come up around this way and get closer to all of this up here. Giant's Thresher. Interesting. Okay. Well, now we can just start the attack here. Okay, pretty good. Took out two of their guys. Um, you want to have someone go again just so that we're closer to that? Probably. Who would we want to get up there? Ephraim or Sybil? Powers. I mean, I guess we could teleport to next turn. So if we just go... Like, you guys go again and hit them. Yeah, because... It'll take a few turns for us to do this. So let's just hit them again. All right, that whole one one side is done. There we go. Nice. Huge for us. Even huger. Massive. Barnabas or Draymond. Let's do this. Okay. Oh, there's a bazaar up there. I didn't see that. Shoot. Well, we have a few turns. All right. We can get you up there next turn. Wait. Seize. Okay. Warlord Tatar or Yaromir. I think Yaromir can do this one. And then, yeah, Diana can go in and take that next turn. Get that, get that. I think we're okay. starting to rain. Okay. 
So let's see what we have here. Matriarch Rosalie, level 35. She's the leader, heavy infantry is cheaper. Hmm, interesting. That's like all of our money. Not really that great for us. Tundra Warrior, Magic Armor. I mean, that's nice, but also uh, leadership. Leadership 60, though. Holy moly. I mean, that's. It is very nice, but I'm not that worried about it. Nor am I uh, about more dragons. So let's see what we have here. Fang of Duros. Minus 100% magic and armor, but massive amounts of strength and health. Oh, this one's also very nice. And that. Okay. One, we're getting another one of those and that. The Pyrocyte, the Obsidian, that, and a Medal of Valor, because we need to. Now it's a matter of, can we sell stuff to get the Fang? I don't think so, as much as that would be nice. I don't know what we would sell to get it. Um, exchanging anything. I don't think we really need to. We should do the gold and the platinum arenas too. Okay, I think we're good. So that means you seize this. And Diana gets to seize that. Huge amounts of money. Look at this, rank S. It's only six turns, that's it, eh? Crestmore Town Square later that evening. You're conflicted. I can smell it on you. I ask you to consider what we are doing and to keep this Beatrix on a short leash. I hear you. Beatrix just falls into our lives, and now we're chasing legends. We know so little about these divine weapons. You've seen Beatrix's magic. That's a lot of power. Aren't you at least curious? I'm always curious, but this is reckless. You must at least give me time to interpret the Historium Magnus. I believe I'm starting to make sense of it. <laughs> of course. Only you would have that kind of patience, certainly not me. Sometimes I can't put thoughts into words. My experience with death and rebirth, it seems beyond the realm of words to describe. Yep, same with this draw to the Divine Shrines, Lysander. I felt something familiar in the shrine at Mount Karnak. It's like I've been living a lie until that moment. How can one resist the long-awaited truth? Could you? Draymond, I swear to be your right hand, and a proper right hand does not let his leader go unprepared. I just ask you to keep your eyes open. There's something going on that I do not like. We are about to pursue the shrine at Greywind Mountain. Let us hope we find the answers we need there. Okay. Interesting, Lysander. Greywind Peak lies before Draymond's army, as do the competitors of the Nephilim Shrine. The film army is prepared to meet fierce resistance from the Imperial garrison here, as Draymond considers that they seem to defend the Divine Shrines more strongly than major cities, it's become plausible that the Nephilim prophecy is going to have serious consequences for the world. Yeah, it definitely will. Let's take a look at these conversations. Beatrix and Lysander, what's your angle? Beatrix, a moment of your time. Oh my gracious, how rude of me. I should have sought you out. Should I wanted to prattle on about nonsense, do forgive me. No prattle. I want to know what you're doing. Why are you here with us? 
This is why I do not trust the intellectual. Too much education, not enough personality. You should make yourself useful and disappear. Everyone has their desires. What do you wish to gain? Desires, darling. I'm already at the top of the totem pole. On that subject, why are you still here admiring the view? Cannot say I blame you. Charming, it seems like you're not going to take me seriously. Just know that I'm not convinced my prophecy and will be watching your every move. Then what are you waiting for? All talk and no action makes Lysander a doll boy. Hmm, you underestimate me, Sorceress. So many have done so. But I've always found a way when others haven't. Goodbye, Beatrix. Okay. Right. This is all... Everybody else. Okay. Perfect. Tech tree. Do we have any? We have no tech. All right. Marketplace. Let's see what we have. We have an Allison. An Archer Captain? Interesting. Uh, Nassim. Assassin's Heart. Ankh. Prodigy. 20% bonus to XP, CP, and leadership growth. That's actually pretty cool. But beyond that... Nothing else overly exciting. Obsidian, though, is always exciting. Same thing with iron. And some more pyrosite. Black belts. Kesh's toolkit. Donar's treatsy of war. Uh, that could be actually quite useful for a lower leveled thing. People here. And in fact, we have a few people that can level up. So let's do this. Change class. In fact, we can get you. If we put you as a knight, we might be able to put him into a different squad. So... Um... Yeah, let's do that, and then we can add in something like that. Yeah. Okay. Um, and we can actually get you guys up. Ooh, Silver Dragon Rider. Heck yeah. And Nibbler, Blue Dragon Rider. Look at that. And now this is a flying unit too. Oh, this is, this is awesome. So Abigail is a flying unit. So, oh, whoops, uh, too far back. Um, so now we're out of Sunstone, which is what we need to upgrade a few of the... Okay, I see. Um, so Beatrix... Now if we do this, we could add in... Hmm. Okay. I'm just... Trying to see who, who we could add in here. Like I'd like to do like one of you guys or something, but having this be a flying unit is huge. Could I dismiss this unit? put cloud render in here what's cloud renders like cloud render is just so good it's imposing tundra guardian colossal he's not even a mercenary leadership skill is huge though and that's what makes this possible um 57, 56, 57, 
40, 57, 56. Okay. I see. Yeah. Okay. So I don't want to change anything there. But I do want to do something with this unit because you need. And if we change you into a knight, we're still on the ground, but this should be okay. Okay. Um, use item. So if we go back to Beatrix then, because you don't have a lot of leadership. If we do this, just use all of them on her. Now we should be able to 10. And nine. And in fact, we can even get you some of these. Um, what would we give you? Some evasion? Not so bad. We want stuff that gives magic, armor. Huh. 25% more damage dealt to larger squads. That's interesting. Yeah, you know what? Some health and armor. A little bit of health, magic, and armor. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Um, unit um, artifacts. In fact, I want to take off that because you don't need it anymore and give you guys something like the other one of these. So you take less damage from on the front row. And maybe even you guys too. Yeah, that'll be actually very nice. So just going over some of these. Some of these artifacts and everything on everybody. Because um, we have, yeah, we are can't really change anything here. Don't really want to change anything there. Can't, can't actually up great anybody um, use item on jewels what was the thing that gives them proof of merit yeah I mean we might as well do that um, on some of you guys right that aren't going to be changing.
there's really no reason not to on like our named people, right? So let's start doing that. Use item Abigail. Just look at that. Huge magic skill increases, everything, yeah. Uh, we could on Nariama. Yep. No reason not to. I'm really not going to change any of these guys' um, classes or anything, right? When they're where they're at. Ephraim. He's been around since the beginning. Let's make him gold too. Why not? Rolants, yeah. Good job, sir. You've been around for a while as well. You guys could become gold. Like, I already did Cloud Render once, so, okay. I mean, this is looking pretty good. So we'll save it here. We've got some gold units. It's fantastic. And there we go. And then next time, we'll either hit into Chapter 22, Grey Wind Peak. I think we'll do one more. And then we'll go back to the, the Gaiden chapters, so, and finish that off. So, thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye for now.